One of my favorite things about a fishing trip is getting out there early, getting on the water before daylight and watching the sunrise, seeing the fog rise up off the water. It's just a magical time. If you're able to get that first early bite, it's a pretty good indicator you're gonna have a good day on the water. From my experience, the boat you choose to fly fish out of can be the key to your success, or it can be the cause of your failure. After fishing out of the Predator MX for years, I've gained a lot of confidence about Old Town's innovation. They've been able to design something that's extremely stable, and that gives me a lot of peace of mind when I'm out here fly fishing on this rougher water. When I do get time to come out on the water, I like to enjoy myself. Take it easy and relax. Now that's a big part of it. Relaxation is a big benefit to fly fishing. It's a big value to me to have a boat that's just comfortable to be in. Uh, one that's got every feature I can think of that I would actually need. Plenty of storage to put my extra gear. Any other time I've ever fly fished out of a boat, it's been very difficult to maneuver, especially when I'm by myself. You always have your hands full or trying to move this and that, and you just can't ever get the fly cast correctly. Uh, this foot controlled rudder system on the Predator XL with the Minn Kota is just an unreal combination. It helps me get where I need to go to present that fly. Fly fishing is an art form, and I definitely don't have it mastered. I don't know if you can actually master uh, this art. But each time I come out here, the trout teach me something different. Uh, I learn from them every time. As this trip winds down, I'm so thankful that I've been able to take in the sights and sounds of today and I'm dreaming of where I'm going to take my Predator XL next.